it's hard not to get excited about what these two guys bring to the field. When you sit down with them and you talk with them, you can understand why players want to follow them. My buddy Ian Eagle is in the booth for CBS this week, and hopefully that makes the prep a little bit easier since you had the Bengals and Raiders a couple of weeks ago in Las Vegas. Ian, what stood out to you from seeing the Bengals in person for the first time this year? I think the word that comes to mind is dynamic. Uh, the fact that they can do it through the air. We've seen it time and time again. And now the way the ground game is going with Mixon, uh, they can beat you in so many different ways. Defensively, they've gotten back to where they were early in the season. And I think this is how it is in the NFL. Bengals fans are in a really good place right now because they believe they've got their guy and the team is building around Burrow. It's a very likable group and you could tell they've got the makings of something special here. Chargers fans feel the same way. You get the Joe Burrow-Justin Herbert matchup on Sunday. Do you think these two guys, who are only in their second NFL seasons, are already among the top 10 quarterbacks in the NFL? Dan, we, we are not known to overhype in the media. It's hard not to get excited about what these two guys bring to the field. When you sit down with them and you talk with them, you can understand why players want to follow them. There are natural leadership abilities there. I can understand why both teams feel very confident moving forward that they've got the right personalities, the right skill sets, and two guys that want to be great. Your partner on TV for many years was Chargers quarterback Dan Fouts. Did he ever say anything to you about the freezer bowl? He did. Dan absolutely said more than once it was the coldest he ever was in his life i do know that there are moments where he can still feel it in his right hand he was frostbitten that is not hyperbole and he said to me that there are still days that he feels it i and this has been great i always appreciate your time look forward to seeing you on sunday dan you're the best